the man who took Castlevania into a new era of exploration nearly 20 years ago with Symphony of the Night a completely revolutionary game for the time is ready to bring his patented side-scrolling brand to the multitude of Kickstarters. And he has demonstrated with a spectacular demonstration in E3 that he remains one of the masters of 2D design. It's been more than five years since anyone has played a game like this one I've ever played, says Igarashi. Movement is the absolute key to an Ida Vanna style experience, and Miriam controls as much as one of Castlevania's Belmonts to make you feel at home but her set of moves, which combines shiny swords and punitive kicks, brings more possibilities to the table. According to Mr. Igarashi, the immense experience of his team has allowed us to quickly identify areas for improvement in the right elements. He is passionate about shaping and perfecting the classic key formula that has made him famous, without the need to build a new kind of experience from scratch. Igarashi, nicknamed simply IGA by legions of fans from all over the world, has left behind more than half a decade of dream far from the class he loves. When an E3 2016 developer explodes and wants to get back in the game, it's Koji Igarashi. However, Igarashi is aware that Bloodline its motivation is not innovation, but the pursuit of perfection. When we took control of the gothic protagonist Miriam, we could feel the fingerprints of IGAs throughout the game. In the best sense of the word, my team has created so many games like this but that we understand the key to the game and how to really experience it, he says. The clip we played already seems to be ready for prime time, and should not improve until the next nine months of polishing. We probably have more collective experience with this type of game than anyone else in the world. Many practical demonstrations of E3 really feel like work in progress that could reach its potential, which is not the case with Bloodstained.